I'm Kate O'Donnell with Mindful Learning Practices. Today we are going to do rapid review on the digestive and excretory systems using digital flashcards. If you would like to purchase a printable set of the flashcards, you can do so at mindfullearningpractices.com. Now join me in starting with a deep breath and our intention statement. My intention for this practice session is to create a stronger neural network related to the digestive and excretory systems so that I can easily access the information when I need it. I know that I am an important part of the universe. My worth is not measured by how I perform on a test or the grade I get in a class. I am loved unconditionally. I work hard because I find joy in learning and I know that I can accomplish anything with effort. My intention for this practice session is to create a stronger neural network related to the digestive and excretory systems so that I can easily access the information when I need it. What is the function of the digestive system? The digestive system breaks down food, absorbs nutrients, and releases waste. What are nutrients? Nutrients are things your body needs, such as vitamins, minerals, proteins, fats, and carbohydrates. What are the two types of digestion? Mechanical digestion and chemical digestion. What is mechanical digestion? Mechanical digestion is when your body physically breaks food into smaller pieces. Chewing and contractions in the stomach are examples of mechanical digestion. What is chemical digestion? Chemical digestion is when chemicals break down food. Saliva and stomach acid are used in chemical digestion. What are enzymes? Enzymes are proteins that make chemical reactions happen faster. What are the five parts of the digestive tract? Mouth, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine. What is peristalsis? Peristalsis is muscle contractions that push food through the digestive tract. What is chyme? Chyme is the mixture of food and digestive chemicals in your stomach. Where are most of the nutrients absorbed into your body? The duodenum of the small intestine. What is bile? Bile is a digestive chemical made by the liver that breaks down fats. What types of nutrients do pancreatic juices break down? Pancreatic juices break down carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. Where do nutrients go once the small intestine absorbs them? The bloodstream. Why do we need to eat proteins? Proteins are necessary to rebuild and grow cells. They can be broken down into amino acids we can use to make new proteins. What are some sources of protein? Meat, eggs, beans, peas, nuts, milk, cheese, and yogurt. Why do we need to eat carbohydrates? Carbohydrates are sources of glucose that we can use to make energy. What are some sources of carbohydrates? bread, pasta, potatoes, sugars, fruits, and vegetables. Why do we need to eat fats? Fats are sources of energy. They can also be used to insulate and cushion our bodies and are needed to absorb certain vitamins. What are some sources of fat? Fish, meat, nuts, oil, eggs. Why do we need to eat vitamins and minerals? Vitamins and minerals are necessary for certain cellular functions. What is the purpose of the excretory system? The excretory system removes waste from your body. Give an example of waste being excreted from the body. Undigested food comes out of the large intestine. Carbon dioxide is exhaled. Salt and water is sweated out. What is the function of the kidneys? Kidneys filter waste out of the blood. What happens to liquid and waste that is filtered out of the blood in the kidneys? Nephrons filter the blood in the kidney and the waste liquid is passed through the ureters to the bladder where it waits to be excreted as urine through the urethra. Closing meditation. Thank you for this opportunity to grow as a learner. I know that taking time to practice remembering will strengthen my neural networks and help me remember what I need to. I know that I am an important part of the universe. My worth is not measured by how I perform on a test or the grade I get in a class. I am loved unconditionally. I work hard because I find joy in learning and I know that I can accomplish anything with effort. After this practice session, I am ready to move on to the next part of my day, focusing on kindness, acceptance, and compassion for others. Thanks for joining me today. I'll see you next time.